What is up guys, it's Cal, and in this video I'm going to show you some uh, fishing achievements. There's one for the Alliance and one for the Horde. This is fishing up Rasparalis and Utaka. Now Rasparalis is a fish that either faction can fish up, but the Horde have an achievement to fish it up, which is around Proudmoor Keep. As you see, I'm actually in front of a Rasparalis school right now, and I just fished one up. And then Utaka is one that is around Dazar Allure, and Alliance have one to fish that up. So with that being said, this is not like Old Crafty and Iron Jaw. There are fishing schools around the area for you to fish up for these two achievements. So Alliance don't have one for Rasparalis, but I'll go ahead and fish in this school anyway, where I've, I've already gotten one. Where is it? It's a, a crafting regent for some reason. Rasparalis right there, and it sells for 50 gold at a vendor. And each one, each pool yields, I, I think about like around three of them. So if you see these schools, well, that's kind of some easy gold right there. So yeah, I just fished up three and I went away. So for the horde, the horde have to come around this area right here. There's, see how it's lighter right there? You can kind of see the pools right now. This is where um, you'll fish them. If you're tracking, you want to know how to track fish. That of course makes things a lot easier. Have that on, come around here and there's, well, there's a guard right there. There's also a guard right there. But if you come like right here, like the fishing school is right there. If you come right here, you should not be bothered by guards. So besides the achievements for Horde, what else is this used for? It's, well, it's used for nothing. It's you just sell them to the vendor. You can uh, sell them on the auction house for some reason. Now I'm going to go ahead and actually buy Utaka on the auction house for, well, first off, it's not a lot of gold. Uh, on my server, it's only like 99 gold, but this is just to show you that I don't believe I'll get the achievement if I just have it in my inventory. Like you have to actually fish it up. So let's go ahead and spawn a mailbox. My Katie stamp whistle. Mailbox, check mail. Yeah, I have it in my inventory, but it did not trigger the achievement because I do actually have to fish it up in uh, Desire Lore. So let me go ahead and show you where that fishing location is for Alliance to get their achievement. And now for Alliance. So I'm at Desire Allure right now. Here we are, in Zoldazar, Dazar Allure, and there is an Utaka school here for the Alliance achievement called uh, Baiting Your Enemy, or whatever it's called. Yeah, Baiting the Enemy, where you have to fish up an Utaka within Dazar Allure and Zoldazar. As you see, I'm right in front of a pool right now. I'm going to explain here in a second, but I just want to fish this up so I can get my achievement. There's my achievement for Baiting the Enemy. So, for Alliance, what you want to do is you want to come to this location right here. This is 4340 43.50 in Dazar Allure. So if you type that in Zuldazar, it won't work. You have to go to Zuld or you have to go to Dazar Allure to type that. And uh, this is the location in case you don't have Tom Tom, which is completely fine. Uh, how I got here essentially is I went across. You can go up here. I would actually recommend going this way because there's less uh, guards you have to worry about, less PvP guards anyway. There's more PvP guards up there. Go around that way, up these stairs around here shimmy up this way and then right here so when you come here chances are there will not be a school there obviously so you want to hide behind this a uh, statue right here you want to hide behind it and there's a pool right there and there's a pool right here one of these pools will spawn it as you see one of the pools did spawn it and i literally was only waiting here for maybe 20 minutes i think so not long at all um i mean compared to some achievements you know it's only a 20 minute achievement, that's not really a big deal. When I came to this location, there were I had to kill this royal guardian, which only has 108k health, it's not a big deal. But then I had to kill two guards, not PvP guards by the way, but they were guards which had like 350 something k health I think. I had to kill those uh, because they wouldn't de-aggro off me, even if you use Fain Death or Shadow Melt or probably Vanish, I don't know, anything like that. But yeah, as I mentioned, hide behind the statue until a pool spawns in either or until a school spawns in either of these two pools. Fish it up and you get your achievement and that is it. So that is uh, baiting the enemy for Alliance and Horde. Uh, also just one other thing, I would recommend doing this. This kind of goes without saying, but you might also think, what is the point of that? But I would recommend doing this with war mode off. Kind of obvious, but then again, you might think, why would that matter at all? Well, because there's a lot of guards around here that are not PvP'd. But anyways, the point I'm making is, uh, you might get attacked by a PvP guard or, or a guard in general, and it will put your PvP on, or it'll put your flag on, 
be more specific. But then after you kill those guards, just wait five minutes and it'll go off. This is just so no players can attack you while you're waiting here to fish. Uh, and that's the, this royal guard is the only thing that pats around here that you kind of have to worry about, I guess. But if you're behind or if you're standing where I am right now, at least you obviously don't have to worry about him. So just stand in this vicinity, wait for the school, fish up, you get your achievement. Uh, this is like the BFA version of the old Crafty and old Iron Jaw, as I mentioned before. But I do think those two achievements, those vanilla achievements, are much more difficult than this one. Because my because the, for the Rasporalis pool, the Rasporalis school, and this Ataka school, I only waited like 20 minutes each for them to spawn. And I got my achievement. So anyways guys, that's the entire video. If you liked it, you can leave a like on it. You can sub to the channel for more videos like this. And I'll see you guys in the next video.